Hey, what's up? Walk with me, talk with me. So let's talk about something here. Let's say you own a business, right? And let's say your telephone, cable, internet at home is with company A. Pick one of the big uh, providers that provide that. And your business, if your business is not inside your home, if your business is in your home, hey, congratulations. You don't have to, you don't have a remote place. Where I'm at is a set, it's a prop. So let's talk about this. Let's say company A does your home, telephone, internet, cable, right? And at your place of business, company A does your telephone, cable, internet. But it seems like both things function the same, whether at home or at your business. And you pay more just because at your business, it's in your business name. Now, do you think that's highway robbery? So I'm saying that to say, think about before you put certain stuff in your business name versus your company name. All right, because sometimes you pay more just for it being in your business name and you're not getting a better service. You're just getting ripped off by them because it's business name. So think about that. Thanks for watching. Check out my website, www.paracletepub.com. I grew up in a family business that has thrived, survived, struggled for 35 years. I have a bachelor's of science in biology. I grew up in the business. I eat, sleep, breathe it, as well as using my biology degree. So check out my website, www.paracletepub.com for my business book. And thanks for watching. And we're out. Oh yeah, before somebody say this, let me address it too. Um, personal name, versus business name. Where there's an either or, your accountant can write it off. So everything doesn't have to be in your business name for it to be written off. Thanks for watching.